everybody. Thank you so much for joining us today. My name is Serata, and this is Andrea, and today we will be sharing with you a vegan pumpkin cheesecake. This cheesecake is sure to please everybody at your next family get-together or a potluck. Super creamy, super delicious. So let's get started. Your first step is to preheat your oven to 350 degrees. Next, we're going to grease our springform pan. Make sure that you have a springform pan for this recipe. If you don't have one, you can probably find it at your nearest grocery store. What we're going to do is take a little coconut oil and put it in the bottom of our pan. Using a paper towel, we're going to spread that coconut oil around to grease the entire sides and base of your springform pan. Now we're going to move on to our crust. So for our crust, we have our graham crackers. There's about one package of graham crackers crushed up. You can crush these by hand or you could throw them in the food processor, pulse them a couple times until you get this nice coarse meal. Next we're going to add three tablespoons of turbinado sugar. We also have three tablespoons of coconut oil and one tablespoon of your favorite non-dairy milk. So you want to mix all of this together until it combines really well. If you don't want to use graham crackers, you could use ginger snap cookies or a shortbread cookie, anything that has a crispy, crunchy texture. Um, make sure to just grind it up the same way and so you have this nice coarse meal. Once your crust starts to come together, we're going to throw it back into our springform pan and press it out to form our crust. Once your mixture is all combined, we're going to transfer it to our springform pan. Now, using your hands, you want to press the crumbs into the base of your springform pan nice and firm. Once you have it pressed down all the way around, we're going to transfer it to our oven and bake for 10 to 12 minutes. While your crust is baking, we're going to make the cream cheese portion of our vegan pumpkin cheesecake. We're going to start in our processor with some soaked cashews, some mashed banana, and two different kinds of sugar, a deep dark brown sugar and a turbinado sugar. We're going to blend these up until they get nice and creamy, and then we're going to add our remaining ingredients. Once your cashews are blended up in the processor, you're going to add the remaining ingredients. You're going to add some vanilla and maple extract, some orange juice and some orange zest, a little bit of cornstarch, which, help, which helps thicken our dough, some pumpkin. We're going to use a whole can of pureed pumpkin, and also some silken tofu, which is a great vegan replacement in cheesecakes and other baked goods. We're going to blend these up until they get nice and creamy. Oh wow, that looks so delicious. Well now that my crust is finished and our filling is all complete, we are now going to transfer this filling into the crust. Go ahead, Andrea. Now once you get it in your crust, you're going to spread it out and then we're going to throw it back in the oven and bake it for 45 minutes. After your vegan pumpkin cheesecake has baked for 45 minutes, let it cool for 15 to 20 minutes and then you're going to move it into the refrigerator. It needs to chill for four to five hours. After you've let your cheesecake chill, remove it from the fridge and now we're going to take it out of the spring form. You want to use a butter knife to scrape along the edges so it's easy to release the sides. Gently release the spring and lift straight over. We hope you enjoy our vegan pumpkin cheesecake. For this recipe and hundreds of others, please check out downtoearth.org and find us on Facebook. Thank you so much for checking out our video and spending time with us. We wish you and your family a happy, healthy holiday season.